Hi Above Life Channel, it's Bridget. This video is a follow-up to my first ever conversation with Amy Winehouse. Now, I did not know anything about her, except that she was a singer and she died. And it was uh, an overdose situation. That's what I think anyway. So I grabbed my cell phone right after I just finished doing the first channel because I wanted to fact check fact check. All right. And you know, I'm not good with the details. I'm just not, I'm not good with the details and I'd like to get better at that. So I'm working on it, but it says, so I was accurate on her, how old she was when she died. She died at 27. Um, she was in, uh, uh, looked like she, her home was in London, England. So she was in the UK. Um, I wasn't sure where, though I kept feeling like there was a separate part. I'm not sure what that has to do with a different place. I think I referred to her, the home of the Beatles or something, which would have been Liverpool, I think, not London. So I don't know, That may, that's a miss. I'm not sure what that's about. And then it says that she died of alcohol poisoning. So I said, it felt like there was like a needle in her arm, like that there was drugs involved the drug was alcohol and it, it doesn't look like there is anything else in her system necessarily. So, um, that was one detail as well that I wanted to check on. And I think that's it. I think that's all that I wanted to, Oh, her death date. So I could feel like there is not activity in 2016. I was thinking 2015 because 2014 felt really light, like it was good or like there was stuff going on or whatever. And then 2015 felt like heavier, like business was happening. And then 2016, nothing. And I'm like, it felt like the ending of something, like a year, what have you. I thought, well, maybe it's December. And then I thought, no, it's, it felt like summer. Like I could feel the summer 15 and summer. I could see 15 and I could see summer. And so she did die in the summer in July, but it was July 2011, 2011. Wow, like way, like way before. So I was totally off on that. So I just wanted to check. I just did the Wikipedia thing to check to kind of see some facts. So why is it that when I do channel people that I really literally don't know anything about or not much about, why do I even share it with you guys if it's like I don't have like the facts straight or the details? Because that's what authenticity is. This is how I work. I want you to see in full transparency, the entire process of things. Now this is different than doing a, a private session or a reading with someone because there's no direct feedback and I'm using a different layer of, of conversation, connection, communication with the spirit world than I do when I have conversation with you because when I have conversation with you or I'm doing mediumship for you, you give me feedback from my brain to be able to also process while your brain is processing. So I'm going through a layering kind of a system, kind of a filtering system. And so I get instant feedback and then I'm able to ask more questions and get more specific information when I'm doing it with a channel, with a spirit that I do not know, it's much more difficult for me. And I'm really not good with the details in the first place. So it really challenges me. And I want to share that with you. And I want to continue to grow and work harder and get stronger in that area because I know that details are a really important thing to be able to have you have the confidence and the faith in the fact that we can all connect with the spirit world. We can all connect with your loved ones who are on the other side and with famous people as well, people we don't know anything about. And so this is one example of that. I hope you do enjoy the video, the channeling with Amy Winehouse. And if you have comments or if you have questions, go ahead and post them in the comments below. Remember, I do read the comments when I'm able to do that. And I do appreciate it. Give the video a thumbs up if you like it. If you appreciate the content and the authenticity for which I share, I, I, I hope that you do. I think that's why you're here. Again, this is Bridget with Above Life Channel. Remember the purpose is to inspire your spirit and to fill you up with hope so that you will focus on your life because this is your life. So live it, live it.
Thanks for watching.